Sofiet's sound system worked fine, nothing fancy, it's easy to use, in other words. I plugged in my iPod for music with no fuss. I use the GPS in my phone these days and have become quite adept at using it without looking at it. I did have a bit of an issue with the car's heater. I adjusted for vent and floor, but it stubbornly blew hot air out to the floor and cool air to the vent. After my Friday meetings were over, I started the 360 mile drive back to LA. It was still raining, with 40 mile per hour winds added for good measure. Lovely. As many will. No, Interstate 5 is plank flat through the San Joaquin Valley. The Fiat showed good stability in the gusty conditions. As altitude increased into the mountains north of LA, the rain followed suit. Traffic was light enough for me to comfortably maintain the speed limit despite the deluge. The original equipment. Nexon Class Premier 215-60R17 tires impressed me mightily. Nexon. Yup, I had to. Look it up too. Korean Tire Company, been around since 1942. The conditions. Certainly got my attention, heavy rain, spray from traffic, curvy freeway. Standing water, streams running across, and more. The tires inspired confidence and provided consistent grip and feedback and a better than average ability to disperse deeper water. After grabbing some dinner at my LAX airport hotel, I returned my ride back to the automobile test fleet garage. I wasn't surprised to find all the other test cars gone for the weekend, but I couldn't help but think someone was missing out. The Fiat 500X Trekking AWD is practical, capable, and a good value with a fun look. That certainly appeals to me. As my taxi splashed its way back to my hotel the radio informed me California was enduring its worst storm in decades. A little smile crossed my face. That was quite a trip, Mr. Fiat, and I think we did okay. As far as I'm concerned, we can team up again anytime.